guess what we got for free? F-R-E-E free! <laughs> <laughs> Not gonna lie, I was actually spawning out in my head as you were saying F-R-E-E free! <laughs> yes guys, we got something completely free. Mm -hmm. Well, I shouldn't say completely free. We did have to pay for taxes. Mm -hmm. We do, well we did have to pay for excursions. Yes. Do you know what it is? Do you know what it is? I'm pretty sure it's in the title, dang it. I spoiled it already whenever the title was up there. But we got a cruise for free, guys. Yes, we did. Don't ask me how we got it, because I still have no idea how yeah. we got it. We don't even know how we yeah. got it, but here we are. Yeah, so, you know, we went on a cruise earlier this year, mm -hmm. and it was a Royal Caribbean cruise. Anyway, we got an email, like, a week or so after that, saying, hey, you want a free cruise? And we're like, let's think yes. about it. Yes. <laughs> That's how fast we decided that we're going to take it, just as fast as Crystal said, mm -hmm. yeah, now. So, we are on a free cruise going to Mexico. Yes, we're going to go to Cosmo. Yes, we're going to Cosmo. We've been to Cosmo in the past five or six years ago at this point. Yes. Our first cruise ever was to Cozumel. And it was so amazing. That the water, water was, was so blue. Jinx. So blue. Oh, you so didn't blue. see it at the same time. I, I thought to pinch you. <laughs> but yeah, it was so blue last time we were there. I don't, I was told that there's actually two ports in Cozumel. Mm -hmm. We had I, some I friends tell that. us that. We actually did not know that. I don't know if it's true. Hopefully you guys were right. But we are going back to Cozumel. Hopefully it's the same port as last time though because we really liked it there. We did. And we had this really fun excursion. You guys are going to see that in this vlog though because it's going to take us Today's one day, tomorrow's the second day. The, the third, third day, day, third day of the trip before we actually get to one of the uh, places, one of the ports, because we're gonna go to Cozumel. We're gonna go to Costa Maya Costa as well. Maya. We've never been there before. Never been there. We actually don't have anything planned for there yet, so we're kinda gonna wing that, but that's a later problem. <laughs> In this video though, we're gonna be you know, showing things around the ship. We are on Serenade of the Seas, yeah. first time ever on this uh, cruise ship. We did take a little look around as we uh, got our stuff settled down in the cabin, mm -hmm. but we're gonna look around afterward but we have to wait for the ship to sail off yeah. into the distance. We actually haven't left the port yet. There's a, is that a cop? There's a cop over there. Oh, there, oh yeah. There's there a cop is. on the water. And there's like a tugboat over there. So here's the view, guys. Oh, it's pretty ugly. <laughs> I mean, the last port was basically just like this. So we've never actually been to this port. We're in Tampa right now. We're sailing out of Tampa, headed to Mexico. You guys can't see the cop I was talking about, but that boat right there, it looks like it's a uh, police watercraft of some kind. Mm -hmm. And then that right there, that tugboat I said was a tugboat, it's not a tugboat. It's a US Coast Guard yeah, I looked at it a little closer. It's US Coast Guard, probably trying to block people from bringing their own personal boats out here because yeah. there are two cruise ships, ours and the one in front of us are about to take off. But yeah, guys, this, this view is not, not the business. I think on the other side of the cruise ship is where we're gonna see like the beaches and stuff so we'll probably go on to the other side once the uh, the ship starts taking off because this side is ugly yeah this side is definitely much better than the other side I mean you see just a lot of houses and some buildings over there but it's still a lot better than seeing that commercial stuff look at those buildings way in the distance no idea what those buildings are I'm sure someone knows that's watching this I have no idea but this right here looks really cool we're getting close to being out of the uh, port area yeah and they're gonna be into the open ocean can't wait till we get down there right here there's some kind of airport oh there's actually a plane <gasps> is it gonna take off right here for us if this thing takes off that would be amazing I think it's about to fly guys oh it is oh what the heck this is the perfect timing oh man we couldn't have timed this perfect like any better Let's see if it takes off, or is it doing a test run? No, it's gonna take off. It's a, um, a propeller one, so you can't really hear it that much. Oh, oh there it goes. That is really cool. Oh, I can't believe that happened perfectly, right as we're passing. Now that right there is a view. Oh, wait, wait, where'd that come from? What? What in the world? Oh, I, can't, I couldn't have done that any better, guys. Is that a view or what? But yeah. <laughs> right? Call me David Attenborough. <laughs> But anyway, that is a great view right there. I don't think we're gonna watch the whole thing as we go out because it looks like we have to go through like a lot more. I thought this was like the main ocean. Well, not the main ocean. You know what I'm saying. I thought this is where we're out of the land. But you can tell in the distance right back there, there's more land jetting out. And this uh, cruise ship in front of us is kind of leading the way. So. Yeah, but we are in the open area. Yeah, so you guys get to see it all. So we're off to Cozumel now. And we're gonna go ahead and head like down below deck because it is hot up here. I think I'm sunburned already. <laughs> Day one, first hour sunburn. This is not good. You know, one of the first things we have to do when we go on a new cruise ship is check to see if they have the good cash games and they have a key master yeah. right here and it has all the money so at the bottom it has some ten dollar bills and then it goes up to 20s and then there's hundreds oh. at the top so already this ship is looking awesome but what's this they also have a coin pusher okay. with money on the edge I well can't wait to play this. yeah <laughs> this was really excited about this one the money's not really on the edge but there actually are bills in there the last cruise ship we got on I think it had bills, but they weren't 20s, right? No, they were like 1s and 5s. Yeah, but this has 20s on 
on the edge, you know we are going to play this. The casino itself is not that big, but it does have our favorite craps right there. So we're going to play that. Can't record that though because it's a table game, but they don't really have that many slot machines. I was expecting it to be a little larger from the videos I saw online. Yeah. They must have been using a GoPro though because it looked way bigger. But this is probably the best part of the casino. Check it out! That is stacks and stacks of money! That is so cool! You know how it's set up right here, it looks like they might be winnable. If you are one of the first probably, few people to play it. Yeah. It doesn't open till like 7.30 tonight though. Uh -huh. So we're gonna have to make sure we're here right at like 7.15 <laughs> waiting in line because we definitely want to try this and try to win one of these bundles of hundreds. Well, it's not hundreds. Bundles <laughs> of a hundred scenes. So check it out, the Windjammer buffet is open right now. So we came in here, just look around, see what they have. Yeah. Crystal even said, oh, I'm not even that hungry. I got a cookie though. She's like, you're gonna get a cookie? I said, yeah, and she just comes back with all this. <laughs> Slice out pizza, some mashed potato. What is this? It's, um, it said beef on it, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> some kind of beef, it doesn't even matter. But I got a burger, I got some cookies, got some fries, and I got a little chocolate bar. It says a chocolate bar of some kind. So here is the room. We actually got a ocean view room. We don't have a balcony, but we do have a porthole right there. You want to go open it up? Is that what it's called? A porthole, right? Yeah. I think that's what it's called. <laughs> You're making fun of what I said there. Oh my gosh, look at the water. Yeah, so we're on the uh, third floor. I don't like it. Yeah, <laughs> what? Like, Why not? It looks Sink. I'm scared. What do you mean? <laughs> We're way up here on the third oh floor. God. We can actually still see the uh, the uh, buildings in the distance out there. We haven't really moved much, but we're just gonna come chill a little bit. We got kind of sunburned. I'm pretty sure oh I'm sunburned. I think I did too. And don't sunburn easily, like super easy. Yeah, super super easy. But I'm like tired now after being in the sun mm -hmm. for a little bit of time. So we might relax on the bed, take a little nap. Not sure. Well, nap time was a success. success. <laughs> hey, that's my line Please here, put Chris. Me on your <laughs> What? This crystal's already bullying me, guys. What in the world? I don't know where we're at, but there's still land there. Yeah, we're like... Shouldn't we be on the off the land already? I have no idea So this that. is the right side. What is the right side of a, a ship? Is it starboard? What the heck is a term for that? Yes, Crystal. <laughs> Listen to this dummy over here. <laughs> You're bullying me! <laughs> I don't know if it's starboard or the other side, the left side, because they, they have different terms for it whenever you turn a ship. Anyway... So if this is the right side of the ship, we how do we still what? Mm -hmm. It's like seven o'clock. We took like an hour and a half half mm -hmm. nap. It's like we're going up the coast of Florida. You guys let me know why we can still see land here because I don't like looking it up. But we are gonna probably head to the wind jammer, <laughs> get some food because we're hungry. So first plate, pizza, ribs, <laughs> mashed potatoes can't go wrong with that combination. Such a weird combination. <laughs> it definitely is strange. That's all the pizzas like I have to try. <laughs> and Crystal got some mashed potatoes, green beans. What is that? bread thing. It said polenta on there. I was like, what the heck is a polenta? Let me try it. What's the other one? It says a uh, cheddar biscuit. Ooh, that sounds chicken. good. I, my favorite vegetable is green beans. Yeah? Yeah, and then I got some mashed potatoes. <laughs> mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. But anyway, this is our view. Talk about fine dining with a view. What in the world? Like, this is much higher than our room is. You know, I think we're like, if we were where our room is, we are about eight... Eight floors above our room right now, because I believe our room is like right here, just straight yeah, down. Yeah, we're on the third floor. Like, yeah. It feels like we're touching the water. <laughs> yeah, we really are. Right now we're on the eleventh floor though. The wind jammer's on the eleventh floor. Now it's dessert time. So these are donuts that they made fresh. Like they were like basically like a biscuit. It was just really flat. Then they fried it one side, flipped over, fried it again. Um, you can get a plain one, but I got, I went for the one with the uh, cinnamon sugar on. And yes, I did put a little bit more cinnamon sugar on it. I'm probably gonna dust a lot of it off, but I wanted it to be on there while it's still hot, so it kind of sticks on there. Of course, I got me some more pizza, and then I got this whoopie pie. I think these are called whoopie pies. I actually didn't see the name over there. It does look good. Hopefully, it's not too sweet though, because after having this, I should probably start with that, because I know this is gonna be really sweet. You guys want to see something crazy? Yes, so them. Look how much air is in this thing. Then where where is the donut? That's a donut hole right I think they here. Fried, I think they fried the donut out of it. Wow, look at this. How cool does it look? Look how blue. It's so blue. It's so oh, there's a lot of white there because of the uh, the waves. Oh man, yeah. So it's actually breakfast, second day. Uh, yesterday kind of uh, disappeared. Don't know where it went, uh, but it's time to eat. We have our breakfast right here. Breakfast of kings. Crystal didn't really want much because she's gonna eat lunch, but I had to get some watermelon because Crystal yesterday got the watermelon. She said it was so good, so I'm so excited about that. Watermelon is my favorite, but I have a, like a, just a plate of a uh, mess here. Like, oh my gosh, no, I got the, I got it on my croissant. No, what a fail! Wow, we timed this so perfectly. It's already lunchtime. It was only like. 
like 10 minutes we had to wait. And I got mashed potatoes, some wedged potatoes, and some fish. I'm gonna try the fish out, hopefully it's good. <laughs> what are you doing, hiding your food? What is it? Why are you hiding your food? Because I didn't oh, get food. <laughs> that is not food. All I got was dessert. Oh my gosh, oh I my forgot gosh. utensils. Oh. All I got was some, they have macadamia cookies up there. Oh my gosh, I, was I super love, surprised we love that. macadamia yeah, cookies. Yeah, yesterday they had the uh, raisin cookies and they were mm -hmm. really good, so I was like, I gotta try these today because the last time I've ever had one was at like Subway, right? Yeah. And then this is a velvet, uh, red velvet cheese, uh, red velvet cake. Sorry. Oh, okay. Yeah, it looks like it's the whoopee thing I had the other yeah. day. Yeah. Did I show that in the video? Yeah, you did, I think. Okay. Yeah, you did. I didn't really like it that yesterday when I tried it because it was a little dry. The mm -hmm. actual like cookie part of yeah. it. Yeah. Hopefully this, this one's a decomposed uh, well, whoopee pie. Except for this pie. up here. Hopefully it's not as dry though. Look how blue the water is. It is so beautiful. Like, I can't even believe how blue it is. Yeah, a second ago Chris was like, whoa, did someone crank up the saturation? Looks For everyone who doesn't know, saturation is like how colorful things are basically. Yeah. And so when you crank up the saturation, you make it more colorful. It's like it doesn't look real. Like that's one of the best parts of coming out here is just seeing how like, look at all this water. What the heck? I hope we don't break down out here. I uh, hope I didn't jinx it. But yeah, the water <laughs> itself is so nice. Like this is like a good thing just kind of here and see by itself. Oh, Chris, look at me. Oh man, I think that might be a thumbnail. So today guys, we spent so much time in the arcade. But right outside the arcade, they have some shuffleboard and we are terrible at this. Except I shouldn't say we because Crystal's killing me. She keeps beating me I don't know if we're playing it right or not, but I'm gonna assume we are Crystal is the best at shuffleboarding Like she's really accurate. Go ahead and show us Chris So if we're playing this right you what you have to do is you want to get it down to that section in one of the numbers It's because you're on camera Chris. Don't get camera shy. Don't come up short. Come on Chris She's gonna get it here. Watch <laughs> Crystal your camera shy. What are you doing? <laughs> All right, you got two more. You're, you're supposed to alternate, but she's only doing right like, like this because uh, I'm recording it. Let's see. Can she make one? There it is. Oh, too good, Chris. Too good. She got ten off. All right, she has one more. Let's see. Can she make it into the? Look at that. You see how good? I don't know if you guys can really see it, but she almost made it into the 10 there. She's been doing that like all the time. Because we were playing out here earlier before we went into the arcade. Oh, is it too bright? Oh, look at that. Now I'm cool. Now you're too cool. But yeah, you know what we just realized? We just were thinking about it. That it's formal night. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we were just talking about or that. Or the fancy captain's dinner, whatever you guys want to call it. That is true. And we did decide that we're not going to do that. We're probably going to eat at the buffet. But we just found out that you can eat at the buffet. It's actually one floor below us, right? I believe it's one floor. Yeah, one floor and there's a spot in the back back there where there are outdoor seating. Yes, we just have to hold And it looks really magical. And we're actually able to like find a spot. Well, there's a lot of spots out there. Okay, yeah. And I think since it's formal night, most people are going to go to the actual dining area where they get served and all that stuff. I don't care to get served. I'd rather just be able to pick it up at my own pace, you know? So right down these stairs is where the food is. So that should be where the wind jammer is. If you walk underneath us, should be. I don't know 100%. But we can still bring the food out here. Why would it be salt and pepper shakers, right? <laughs> but look at this view. The water looks so beautiful. I love, like, the white ripples. We have to go down there, Chris. So yeah. Pretty. Keep telling me your story about water because this is beautiful. <laughs> it is very beautiful. But no one's actually eating out here. Maybe yeah. the buffet's not open yet. Oh, maybe it's not. I don't even know what time it is, to be honest. Me either. Like, but no one has food so must not be <laughs> open <laughs> but yeah look at this it looks so cool I hear plates actually oh listen to it you can actually hear the waves oh the people who have rooms down here have amazing views like this is like so nice to look at yeah probably without a doubt but look at that so pretty I don't know how we timed this so perfectly but we have perfect real estate here on the back because look at this literally right up against the glass yeah, like too. literally right now is when the buffet opened for the uh, start eating time. And yeah. like, it's crazy that we did this. So we have our plates here. I have some pork loin. <laughs> I have some, oh, there's a green beans. beans with like almonds in it apparently. Oh, okay. Then I have some seasoned uh, carrots. carrots. <laughs> I got some, what, I can't think of anything what I got. I got mashed potatoes. No, what is that angel? Mashed potatoes. No. What is it, Chris? Potatoes. Oh my God. <laughs> yes, I got potatoes. I'm not sure what this is. It looks like it's chicken of some mm -hmm. kind. Not exactly sure, but I got it because I was like, huh, let me try it. Crystal, what do you have? I'm super excited because I, they have keys. I love keys. And then this is a potato gratin, gratin, I don't know, <laughs> green beans, um, Monte Cristo grilled cheese. I have no idea. And then steak. Yeah, I saw the steak. I almost, I was about to get a steak, but I was like, that can wait until the next round. I didn't get the memo. It's dessert time already. Well, it's not dessert time, but... 
I don't want to get full on food before I eat my dessert. So no. it's dessert time for me right now. Okay. okay? <laughs> so mm. you got um, soft serve ice yeah. cream. I didn't want to get in a comb because I just wanted a little bit of ice cream to go with the rest of my desserts here. What is this big chocolate thing? What is that? This thing? Yeah, it looks like a ganache of some sort. I don't even know. I didn't look at the name. Okay. This had a weird name, but it's kind of like a strawberry something. Oh. It said it was a cake of some kind. Oh, really? And that is a vegan cookie. Oh, a vegan cookie. Yeah, so hopefully it's all good. My words exactly, Chris. <laughs> I don't know if you could hear her, but she said, wow, look at the sunset. That is very beautiful. That was my next words. Chris, come on. Leave some words for me, please. Oh, I gotta be careful to hold on to the phone. Look how blue that water is. It's pink. Crystal said earlier, I don't know if I mentioned this, but she said it looks like mini golf water. Yes. You ever seen the water at like mini golf courses? It looks like they dye it blue, which they definitely do dye it blue. Yeah. That's what the ocean water, you know, it looks like toilet water. <laughs> when you put like the little blue, the blue pills. Pill, the cleaning blue yeah. Pill. Oh man, it's so pretty. Look at Crystal. She's beautiful. And then look right over here. Doesn't compare to Crystal, but it's still nice. It's, it's a really nice sunset. Ah, uh, feels good out here. Crystal saw, what did you say, like a floating basket? Yes, I saw like a copper metal basket floating in the ocean. How would it be floating though if it was copper? Oh, like a, like a, that color. That maybe, color. oh, okay, I actually saw it too and it looked like it was metallic. Mm -hmm. So maybe it was just plastic that was like painted. Oh, look, there's birds. Crystal saw birds out here earlier. She's like, we must be close to land. Yes, we must be. I, the wait, yeah, there is. There's a cruise ship way, way over there. I don't, I don't know if you guys see it. But I think it might be that the birds have like made their home on the ship somewhere. <laughs> I don't know if that makes sense. But I, I don't know. I mean, there's a lot of birds flying around that aren't like really big birds. So it's very empty here at the mini golf course. So we're gonna do one hole. This is actually, I believe, the last hole of the course. But there are a couple people on the other side and it all looks exactly the same. There's no real theming to the uh, mini golf here, except they have like lighthouses. <laughs> All right, let's see how many it takes Crystal to get into the hole. Can she make it in three, two, oh, <laughs> I was going to say three, two, one. All right, she's going to make it in four, right? Yeah. Four. Oh, you didn't make it. All right, this is number five. <laughs> oh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> you can't get it. That thing made me mad. All right, there he goes. Whoa! Hey, not bad. All right, how many did it take you? Um, probably Unlimited. like 15. <laughs> Whoa! That's two. Oh, wow, that is actually really good, Angel. Okay. <laughs> can I make it in three? Yeah, you can make it in three. Can he do it? Oh! You're going to yell four! Four! <laughs> that one robbed you! Five! <laughs> You know, we were actually going to do the rock climbing today, but the arcade kind of uh, had us absorbed over there. And now I don't think we can do this until the last day because tomorrow, bright and early. Oh, so excited about that. Yeah, tomorrow, bright and early, we have to go do our excursion. Yes, tomorrow is Cosmo. Yes, we'll be in Cosmo tomorrow. Very excited about that. I think we're probably going to wrap up this video here, though. Yes, I mean, so. there's not much more to really do tonight. We're probably going to go to the casino a little yeah. bit. So if you guys are interested in that kind of stuff, check out our other channel. Yeah, links will be in the description. Oh, now I have to work and put links oh, in the description. Thanks a lot, Chris. <laughs> oh, let me actually show this. There actually is a slide here. Oh, it's yeah, it's, like it's a pretty area. small. Yeah, this is like the little kid splash yeah. zone. There's only one pool on the ship. Yeah, which I was which, really surprised about. Besides this one. This is like a little kid. I don't, I don't count this as a pool unless yeah. it's for kids. But like, this is a little bitty baby slide. <laughs> there actually is a smaller slide. You can't even see it. It's like underneath. Let me show you. <laughs> This slide is tiny. Look at it. That thing is literally like two feet. I mean, for a kid, I'm sure that's really exciting. Oh, there is this one cool thing, the solarium. Oh, yeah. Before we end this video, let's go show the solarium because it's like an indoor area that has a pool. And it's like AC it and everything. Cool. It looked really cool when we got here the first day. We're like, what the heck is this? So on our way over here to the solarium, we found out there is another pool. We just, I don't know, we completely forgot about it. And there's a pool in the solarium itself, but this looks really neat. Has like the elephants back there. Fancy. Yeah, this part right here is like enclosed. So mm -hmm. during the daytime, it's like AC'd in here. Right now, I don't feel like, don't feel like there's much AC. No, it's not. Yeah, but the first day we came in here, it was like really hot outside. Mm -hmm. And then we came in here, it was like, ah, oh, nice and relaxing. Has like a little bridge that goes over That's the really pool. Cool. 
Yeah, this is a really nice area. This area right here looks so cool, guys. Look at this. So this is the Syndrome, which I think is similar to when we were on Mariner of the Seas, like the Promenade kind of in a way. So every floor has something different, like uh, that's vintages. I don't know if that is like drinks, I guess, or wines. You can book the uh, other cruises if you want to book future cruises over there. Downstairs, I have like they actually have live performers on here singing like most of the day. It feels like. There's also a bar too. Oh, is there? Yeah. But yeah, this whole area right here looks so cool because they have the lights lit up and everything. This is like really neat. But this is where we're really gonna end this vlog, guys. Crystal was saying this morning when we woke up, she's like, you know, after all, I don't hate this porthole. <laughs> I like it a lot, actually. Yeah, when we woke up, it was so cool. It was so cool. Like once you get over the fact that you're way at the bottom and you might be able to touch the water yeah right <laughs> but if you get over that it's super cool like having this huge window yeah and being like right next to the water i like it cool. yeah especially this morning when it's really really bright and yes. even right now i don't know do i like this better than a balcony though i i think yes yeah i yeah i don't know it, just, it looks like when we woke up this morning we just opened the window and looked that's out true there. It was so cool. but we did go out on the balcony in the that's other room true. it's hard to say i don't know yeah i could go either way personally i could go either way but we are gonna wrap up this vlog here next vlog will be us in cozumel excited for that but anyway guys hope you enjoyed the video we'll see you next time bye, bye.